to make sure I'm in live chat. There we go. Who all's here? It's Joanne Fafford. <laughs> Hi, Joanne. Hello, Lisa. Hi, everyone. How's everyone doing on this wonderful Saturday? Lisa Farley. Hi, how are you, Lisa? I'm glad to see you all. I'm not going to say hi individually because someone said it sounds like romper room. So <laughs> I'm just going to say hi, everyone. <laughs> Deanna, Sue. Hey, Randy Heilman. Ann Richardson. What's romper room? What's Ramper Room? Ramper Room was a kid's show that was on in the 60s that I used to watch. And the teacher had this mirror. And she would hold up the mirror and, it, and they had like the swirly like design in the mirror. And she would say, what was it? Romper, stomper, bomper, do, I don't know. And she'd say, I see. Casey and Stanley and you know in the mirror or whatever. I feel like so that was an accurate statement, whoever made that. Well <laughs> <coughs> Hey Chris ABQ Romper Stomper Bumper Boo. Okay, yeah. <laughs> hey Katie, how's it going? Sue Golombeski. Oh, me too, Lori. I love that show. You know what other show I used to love too is the, um, remember the Gentle Giant? Hey, Cheryl. It's Fat Bird Finds. Hi, girls. Hello, Wendy Levon, Diana, Kathy, <laughs> Pamela Blanchard's in the house. Hi, Pamela. There is Joanne. I like how you literally said. <laughs> That I wasn't going to do it, and I'm doing it. I know, it's a habit. I can't help it. It's a habit. <laughs> hey, Deanna. Hi, Chicago lady. Mary Cox. I know, I sound like a romper room. Oh, well. Hi, Myrna. Linda Barnum. Annie B. Thrifty. Hi, Cynthia. Received your creamer. Awesome. Awesome. Lynn Hampton, Deb Clark. Hi, Virginia. Judy Reardon. Oh, how's married life going? Kathy wants to know, Clements. Um, it's been rough. Yeah, <laughs> not for him and I, but situations. Yeah, I wish I wish I had uh, something better to say, <laughs> but I don't. <laughs> Life happens, you know. Oh, awesome! That's great, Ginger Girl. Good. Pickle Tink, how are you? I hope you're feeling better. Miss Beverly. Is 
It is Mr. L. Page. Oh, the Three Stooges. Yeah, we can't forget them. Oh, my God. I love the Three Stooges. They were awesome. Hello, Stephanie Barber. Hi, Lori. Diane. Rebecca. Cam's Follies. Hello. Well, while everybody's popping in, um, I if you all saw my last haul video, I asked everybody's comments on um, if they wanted more offer ups or just like a, um, a small amount of offer ups and just basically what your thoughts were on the off offer up situation. And most of you said you don't like a lot of offer ups. You you would you just would like offer ups on like really unique items or you know uh, good Pardon items me. and then set prices on everything else. Pardon me, you didn't ask my opinion. Well, you weren't here, <laughs> so because I personally hate with a burning passion. A crap ton of offer ups. They drive me insane. So, with that being said, I am just going to do my normal amount of offer ups. Normally, it's five or six offer ups uh, per sale, and then the rest of the items are going to be um, set prices. Um, also, um, I just want to say if there's anybody new here today, that has never bought from me before, um, you will need to um, email me your YouTube name, your real name, if it's different than your YouTube name, your mailing address with the zip code, and your PayPal email address um, before you um, can offer on any items. Uh, reason being is that I've, I've had a lot of, um, people that will buy Thank things you. and never send me their information. So therefore those items that other people might've wanted are now just sitting. So I don't like getting ghosted. So this is the reason for. Um, if you want to call it pre-registration, that is why um, I do that. And even with even with the pre-registration, I still will get people that don't pay their invoice. So I just start adding names to that list, and I will not like acknowledge those people's offers if they, you know, happen to offer on anything. Um, it is a cruel thing to do, you know? I mean, you're not only are you screwing me out of a sale, you're screwing other buyers out of something that they wanted. You know what I mean? So if you have no intentions on paying for anything, then don't offer up on it. It's very simple. Just don't offer. Stay out of it, <laughs> you know? So I mean I'm not I'm not trying to be nasty, but I'm you know that's the way it is. So my flashlight. So with <laughs> Lori, hallelujah. So with that being said, um we will be putting my email address in the chat uh periodically throughout the sale for anyone that is new. Um, to pre-register. <clears throat> so today I have quite a mixed bag of items. I do have some really awesome items for offer ups and I have a very good variety of things. I have some <clears throat> linens, I have some milk glass, I have some uh, craft lot um, I have salt and pepper shakers. I have, um, oh, planters. 
The whole nine yards. No new bedroom doorknob. No new bedroom doorknob yet. Actually, <laughs> I did stop at Fuller's yesterday. <laughs> and I did not see one doorknob in there. And I was very surprised about that. But uh, I will be going to uh, Home Depot at some point in the next few days to purchase but, one. I mean, you really don't shut your door, so it's really not that big of a deal. Well, I actually locked myself in there the other day. And it's a good thing your brother was here. I mean, I could have climbed out the window. I shut the door to get dressed because he was up here. And I couldn't open the door. Even though I was on the inside and could turn the thing, it just wasn't happening. So he had to, you know, shimmy the whatever. <laughs> Gotta say, not shocked. <laughs> oh, well. <laughs> Poop happens. <laughs> All right, so I guess we can get started. It is Deanna okay. All right. The thrifting gods, may they be with you today. So, um, did you put in my, um, yes. okay. All right, well, let's get started then. <laughs> Okay, I am going to start off with these two items. I also have a set of Bailey's uh, cups. However, this one is a signed one by Helen Hunt. This was a, uh, I guess, a promotional uh, cup. It was signed by Helen Hunt for the Los Angeles Youth Network. So I have this one and I have this one. They both um, they nice. both have the yum. Well, this one has yum inside. Uh, this one, it says Bailey's on the inside. So uh, they are in perfect condition. There's no cracks, no chips. You will get the pair of these for uh, $18, and they are number 45. $18 for the pair, number 45. Blue Flamberg. Okay, we have Blue Flamingo for the Bailey's Cups. Thank you very much, Lori. <clears throat> All right. She said, yay. <laughs> Hello, beautiful Melissa Lynn Colbert Amyot. Well, that was a mouthful. Holy moly. You already had to refresh, Gina? Uh-oh. You're in live chat, right? Just make sure you're in live chat. All right, next up, I have a very, very cool set of salt and pepper shakers. They are, they are. Will you grab the strawberries? I want to show them because I talked about them when I um, purchased these. So um, if you guys will remember, when I, when I showed these in my haul video, I referred to these. These uh, I purchased from Cindy at Cindy's Thrifting again. And I absolutely love them. So when I found these, I was ecstatic. So let me put these down. So these are mine. These are not for sale, but I just wanted to share them with you because I think they're so pretty. I love them. So these are, as you can see, grapes. I love the detailing on the bottom. Very, very pretty. Aren't they pretty? I love them. I wish they would have made the grapes like purple, like purple glass would have been cool. But, you know, whatever. So these are going to be $12 and they are number 39 
$12, number 39. Hey, Christy. She's sneaking on at work. Cheryl Hoskins. Cheryl Hoskins. You got them, Cheryl. Thank you. Sneaking on at work there, huh, Christy? Couldn't stand it. <laughs> All right. Um, next I have, let's do this guy. I think he's so cool. Um, the German Shepherd. Yes. Next I have this Avon uh, decanter, um, German Shepherd. And he is very stoic looking. As they are. As they are, yes. He's in perfect condition. No cracks, chips. Um, it does say Avon on the bottom. I think he's really cool. If I had a German Shepherd, I would definitely keep this. But I do not. I only have cats. So, he is $8, number 50. $8, number 50. Myrna Spratt. Myrna! You got them. Thank you, Myrna. So my friend Joanne um, Baber had, I think it was, jo was it Joanne Baber or, dang it. I can't remember. I, I don't know why I get them, the two confused. I think it was Joanne. It was either Joanne Baber or Joanne Fafford. You're both here. Which one of you sent me the box of goodies and said I could sell or whatever I wanted to do with them? I, I want to say it was Joanne Baber, but I'm probably wrong. Because we all know I have. Okay, see, I was wrong. It was Joanne Fafford. Okay, Joanne. So you're going to remember this next item. I have this beautiful cloisonne trinket box. Oh, you haven't sent yours yet. <laughs> That's okay. I didn't know you were planning on sending one. <laughs> um. It's beautiful, um, and that's the inside. Your package came yesterday. Grandma, they're salt and pepper shakers. Let's what? <laughs> Let's name them. Which ones did you get, Robin? Because I forget. Oh, were they the chef ones? <laughs> So it's in excellent condition. This is the bottom. And this is going to be $12, number 29. $12, number 29. Trisha's here. Hi, Trisha. KCS. Fine. KC, have you pre-registered? Isn't it pretty? Is that Mary Beth or Laura? I'm going to have to go out and come back in because my okay. chat's going slow. All right. <laughs> okay, thank you very much. <laughs> Linda, you got to learn when the package comes... You gotta snag it and hide it and don't open it till any nobody's home. Okay, That's so what you have KCS to do. That's fine. What was the number of that one? Um, it was number 29. 29, yes. It's kind of like when you're bringing things home and you don't want your husband to see that you bought stuff, you know? Hey, Kim. Kim, I got to say, you did an awesome job on your live sale the other day. You were fantastic. So, very good. All right. Um, I have, okay, wait, somebody just said they sent 
You sent my information. When do you actually pay? Okay, so um, Annie, what I will be doing is um, after the sale, uh, probably not until tomorrow, I will package everybody's items and I will weigh them. And then I will send you an invoice via PayPal, which is why I need your PayPal e email address and your shipping um, address. All right, next I have a blast from the past, these vintage uh, Spice of Life uh, milk glass coffee cups. And I would say this is a B handle. That's what I'm calling it, right? Looks like a heart. Uh, so I have a set of four of these and they're all in excellent condition. There's really no paint loss or anything on them. They're in great, great uh, shape. Uh, so you get the set of four for $12 and they are number 13. The set of four, Spice of Life, for $12, number 13. And Bur Burris. Yep, my chat's so behind and I completely went out. I wonder I how come. Thing. You got them, Ann Burris. Thank you very much. Yeah, these are really nice cups. I mean, they, look at that. There's like no, no paint loss or anything on the designs. So that's why I picked them up. Normally you'll find them and half the pictures are gone on them. And All right, I have a couple more glass flower frogs for you guys. Um, I have two. This one is a little bit smaller than this one. Um, they don't have, I don't see any chips or cracks or anything on them. They're both in really good condition. So um, as I said, I have two, they're $8 each. The first per, two people to type in number 15 will each get one. Number 15, $8. Lisa Farley gets one. And Debbie Vitale gets the other one. Actually, there is a little teeny like flea bite right here. They do not glow. Um, I already checked them beforehand and they do not glow. Unfortunately, I have my black light here and yeah, they don't glow. Well, looks like you're going to have to tell me who um, gets it. Uh... Um, it was. No, I already got it. I already, but I'm just oh. saying you'll have to say it out loud because they're not coming They're not coming across. Way okay. After. All right. Jessica's having a lagging problem, so I'm going to have to tell her who the person is that gets it because they're not, she's not getting it till way after. So I don't know what the issue is, but, uh, anyway, so, all right. Um, let me see. I have this. I think this is like totally mid-century modern and it is this awesome, it's made by Wade. It's Wade Golden Turquoise, England. And it is this, uh, I'm calling it a nut dish, cashew dish, whatever kind of nuts you like. It's got a beautiful strawberry design on there. And then it has like this texture, like a pebble texture. No chips, no cracks. Yeah, it's awesome. Um, it is $13 and it's number 22. $13, number 22. Hey, Nebby, Mary Cox gets number 22. That just came across. Oh, did it? Okay, so, all right. You got it, Mary. Thank you. 
I'm about, I would say, 15, 20 seconds delayed. Are you really? Yeah. Wow. <laughs> That's weird. All right. So, I don't know if we have any people out there um, that collect decks of cards, but I do have, <clears throat> excuse me, a vintage deck of cards here. Um, they are perfect. All the cards are there for both decks. Hello, Lisa. How are you? Um, so these are going to be $6, and they're number 16. $6, number 16. I tried that, Angel. I tried everything. Blue Flammer. Okay, you got them, Lori. I was trying to put my tag back inside so I do not lose it. Alrighty, I think I'll do um, one more regular item and then we'll do an offer up. So, um, I was going to sell uh, these separately, but I decided to do them as a lot. Um, let me take the tag off. So, this is going to be for both um, items. I have this brand new... Uh, Ratzenberger or uh, Ravensburger puzzle. <laughs> I was thinking of uh, John Ratzenberger from Cheers. <laughs> uh, it is brand new and sealed. This beautiful puzzle of the castle. Um, I forgot the name of the castle. It's on the side, Sunny yeah. Netherlands or something. Sunny Neuschwanstein. Sunny Neuschwanstein. <laughs> so you're going to get the puzzle. And you are also going to get this brand new sealed in the box Stow and Go puzzle mat. It's also by the same brand. Which is also by the same brand. Exactly. So you will get the two pieces. And they are going to be... $16, number 38. $16, number 38. And I sis. see sis. Okay, so they're coming across quicker now, huh? Oh my God. All right. You got it, sis. Since everybody during quarantining has been loving doing puzzles. I know, right? <laughs> All right. What's the matter, Lori? I see what I see. Dang. What? What? <laughs> oh, you've been wanting a puzzle mat? Oh, cool. Awesome. Brand new in the box, girlfriend. Can't beat that. Oh, you're lagging, Lori. Oh, I know. Jessica's lagging over there, too. I don't know what the problem is. Um, all right. I think I'm going to do. All right, so this next, this offer up item is actually um, something of mine that I have decided to part with. I'm just kind of tired of them, and I know that people love these as much as I do. So instead of doing them singly, I am going to offer them as a lot. So, they all, go they all go together, and it's just much easier. So, this offer up item consists of these awesome mid century modern, look at the face, Siamese cats. So, we have this one, we have this one. We have this one, and we have a set of salt and pepper shakers. 
Now, the one shaker has a little nick on his ear right there. Um, this one has a teeny little couple little nicks on that ear. But they both have their stoppers. So, this is going to be for a five-piece lot. Uh, the cats are all in great condition. Um, there are no chips or anything on, on the cats. And this one is actually Napco wear. And so is this one. And this one has felt on the bottom, so I don't know. But I'm assuming they're all Napco wear. So, for this uh, set of five, we are going to start offers at $15. So, as soon as Jessica puts start in the chat... We will go starting at $15. Are you ready? Okay, go ahead. Start. You had too many things to do at one time. <laughs> Everybody started before we put start in there because they're used to doing it. Um, <laughs> so, so far we have Old Stuff Beth at 32. Jeffrey Ross is at 50. Pickled Tink is out. So Jeffrey Ross is the one to beat at the moment. Tammy Christofferson's at 55. Elizabeth Gove is out. Margaret Gwen. Hi, Margaret Gwen. Margaret Gwen is out. Hello, Elizabeth Gove. Lori Wortley is at 56. Jeffrey Ross is at 60. How much time is left? Uh, 42 seconds. We have 42 seconds left. Lori Wortley is out. Tammy is at 62. Okay, so right now we're at $62. And how much time? 15 seconds. There's 15 seconds. Okay, so Jeffrey Ross is out. So, it's looking like when the time runs out that it's going to go to Tammy Christofferson. I believe. All right. All right. So, so we're going to just refresh real quick and just double check. Tammy Christofferson at 62. All right. Tammy Christofferson at $62. Congratulations, Tammy. Thank you so much. Where are they at? What's that? Hey, Soul Nate. How you doing? Are there an offer up? Did I put them extra? No? No, you have them in the Okay. Yeah, they're number 10. Yeah, um, I'm sorry, I forgot to tell you that. So these are number 10, um, Tammy. Not that it really matters, but I'm just saying. All right. Okay. Hey, Poodle. How you doing, girlfriend? Uh, the email, Jessica, can you put the email in again for me? My daughter's putting it in right now. Her name is... Um, is it, is it under, oh my God, mm -hmm. O-M-G-A-W-D, Jessica. And she will be typing it in for you. All right. Next, I have a beautiful set of salt and pepper shakers. Um, you will have to get, uh, I have one cork. The other one does not have its cork. But these are gorgeous. Look at these. Aren't these pretty? I absolutely love the, ridge, the ridged um, pattern on them. Just beautiful. 
These are going to be $10 and they are number 12. $10, number 12. Yeah, they're very pretty. Very pretty. Alrighty. Mm, Margaret Gwen. Margaret Gwen. You got them. Thank you very much. All right. So if y'all saw my last haul video, you will remember this next piece. It is this gorgeous blue milk glass uh, pitcher. It has the cherry pattern on here. It's absolutely gorgeous. And it has the pretty scalloped um, edging around the top. No cracks, no chips. This is all like right in the, de the design of the glass. Hey Sylvia, I'm good, how you doing? Listen to Linda, she said mine. <laughs> this is going to be $15, number 17. $15, number 17. Hey, Sam, Angel, Angel Burba, you got it. Congratulations, it's a beautiful piece. All right, um, let's do another piece of milk glass. So I have this really pretty piece. It of course is Fenton. I, I know it's Fenton, it's not marked, but it is this beautiful ruffled bowl. However, it does have a little issue. Um, and I didn't even notice it till I pulled it out for the sale. Right here, it was broken and re-glued. You can see that pretty well right there. And you can see it from the inside also. So that is the issue that this beautiful piece has. But it really doesn't take away from the beauty of it, you know, it's, it's still gorgeous. So this is going to be $12 and it's number 31. $12, number 31. Hey, Jackie. Uh, Celeste. Celeste, eight S-A-T-X. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you got it, Celeste. <laughs> All right. Next, I just have this adorable little figurine. I don't know why I cannot pass these little cute, little cuties <laughs> up when I see them. Look at this little guy. <laughs> He is a Lefton. Hey, Carolina Princess, Beth. He is a Lefton piece at that. Look at how cute he is, given the side eye. He's adorable. <laughs> he would look so cute, like, inside a potted plant. Oh, my goodness. He is $6 and he is number three. $6, number three. Yes, he is very sassy. <laughs> Myrna. <laughs> Myrna Spratt, you get the sassy gardener dog. <laughs> number three. Yes, number three, Myrna Spratt. <laughs> okay. okay, thank you, Anita. Alrighty, um, 
let's do some linens. Okay, next up, I have these really cute handmade. Oh, I'm so excited to get rid of those. <laughs> I'm assuming that these are like pot holders or whatever, but look at. We have their little dresses. They're absolutely adorable. This one is a little bit older and it's not as um, fluffy as, as these. It's a different type of yarn. Yeah, maybe. But you get the set of three of these for $10 and they are number seven. $10, number seven. Oh, happy and hearted. You got them, Kathy. Thank you. That, that's all coming in right now. Oh, is it? Yeah. All right. So you're good over there? No. Oh, you're not? That's what I just said. They're oh. all just coming in now. Oh, okay. All right. No problemo, Kathy. Thank you very much. Okay. We all know Valentine's Day is coming up soon. Oh, what are you doing? And, you know... Oh, Somebody might want to make like a romantic dinner, you know, for their significant other. And, you know, why not make dinner, if I could get it out of the bag, why not make dinner wearing this? <laughs> that looks big enough for a five-year-old. <laughs> this lovely organza. Apron. Looks like a curtain. Yes, just wear this and some pearls and you'll be good to go. June Cleaver, you're not. <laughs> so this apron is going to be $10 and it's number 46. $10 number 46. Oh my God, I am laughing at Paula. <laughs> oh, I just think it's cute. <laughs> oh my goodness. Paula, you Melissa, are- Melissa, Lynn, Colbert, and Leia. Melissa, you got it. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Oh dear, that was funny. Oh, all right. <laughs> okay, next I have, this is uh, by your girl Lauren Conrad. Didn't you like Lauren Conrad? This is a Lauren Conrad mug. From Kohl's probably. I absolutely love the colors of this. I and it comes with the little spoon. It still has the tag on there. I love it. It's going to be $10 and it's number 47. $10, number 47. Shirley Pearl. Shirley Pearl. You got it, Miss Shirley. Thank you very much. Um, all right. So I know there are some people that like peacocks. So I thought I would show these. It is a set of uh, pictures. And they look to be like 12 by 12. Um, let me measure them just to be on the safe side. Yes. They're like 12 and a quarter by 12 and a quarter. 
And the colors are really, really pretty, I think. So you will get the pair of these for $20, number 49. $20, number 49. Polly's Prophets. Okay, you got them, Paula. Oh, whatever. <laughs> All right, I'll set these over here. Alrighty, uh, let's see. Okay, next I have um, a beautiful, she, she's gorgeous. Her dress reminds me of Anna's from Frozen. It is, she is simply beautiful. And she is also a planter. She is in excellent condition. There are no cracks and no chips anywhere. Nothing has been re-glued on. Somebody said, Binks is awfully quiet today. I know. <laughs> she is just gorgeous. She's $20, number 30. $20, number 30. Oh, who do we have? We have, Sue yep, Sue Golombeski. You got it, Sue. Thank you very much. She's gorgeous. I love pink and green together. I just think it's so pretty. All right. All right. I have a very cool vintage piece. Um, this is a Japan piece. And it is this awesome hors d'oeuvre dish. So you have this piece in the center that you put all your little toothpicks in. And then you can put your cheese, your pepperoni, or fruits, whatever, and you just grab a toothpick and pick them off the plate. I love the, the design of it. It's awesome. There is the Japan mark on the back. Hi, Sandy Bailey. Isn't it cool? I love it. I like the, the peas. <laughs> It is just adorable, and I do not believe there's any chips or cracks anywhere on here. It does have crazing because it's probably from the 50s. Um, so this is $14, and it is number 26. $14, number 26. Cheryl Hoskins. You got it, Cheryl. Cheryl Hoskins. I believe I'm just going to double check. Yep, Cheryl Hoskins. All right. Why don't you start clearing some of this stuff off? So that way well, I was, I know, I was trying to do a little bit from each side to kind of equal it out. <laughs> All right. Next, I have this very cool rooster ashtray. Um, it is Pensbury Pottery. Uh, no cracks, no chips. You don't have to use it for an ashtray. I mean, you could prop it up on a shelf just for decoration. You could put cashews in it. You could put cheese in it. No cigarettes. Very cute. $12, number 40. $12, number 40. Hello, Steve. Cheryl Hoskins. 
You got it. All right. What happened to Randy Heilman that she's on the mend? What did I miss? What happened, Randy? Happy and Herna. Jess, where was I on 30? Uh, oh, a sinus infection. Oh, those are the worst. Um, you were the second to last person that came through. Second to the last, um, Kathy. All right. Next, I have a beautiful piece of Amberina glass. You can see the gorgeous yellow color in the bottom there. And it has a, such a pretty pattern. Um, and the, the yellow does glow. It is beautiful. Um, it does have like a scratch that's like right in the glass. I don't know if it's a manufacturer's defect. See that right there, you guys? Right here. It's like right in the glass. So I think that was a manufacturing flaw. But anyways, this, um, this gorgeous bowl is $16 and it's number 23. $16, number 23. Straw Mark, that's it. That's it. I couldn't think of the name. Thank you. Uh, Diane McIn McIntosh. Diane McIntosh. You got it. Thank you. All righty, uh, let me see here. How about a really cool wrought iron, I'm assuming, um, trivet. I think this is so cool. Check this out. This is, this is awesome for that rustic, um, a rustic uh, decor uh, for a cabin or if you have rustic, uh, decor in your home. This is really, really cool. It is made by Apco Japan. There's the sticker. And it's just a really cool piece. And it's good size. It's probably about a pound, I would say. It is $12 and it's number 28. $12, number 28. Hi, Judy Scallet. How are you? Woodland Collectors, yes. Sue Golombeski. Sue Golombeski. You got it, my friend. Cool piece. I almost was going to keep it for myself, and I said, you know what? I think I got enough trivets for now. <laughs> so, all right, there we are. Um, okay, I have another piece of uh, hobnail milk glass. Is this from the archives or is this? Yes, new? this is the archives. This is a, just a little uh, bud vase. And it is actually eight inches tall. No cracks, no chips. It is $6, number 21. Six dollars, number 21. Susan Cole. Okay, Susan, you got it. Hi, Maria California Thrifter. Excuse me, my lips are dry. All right. Well, I have a very cool piece for you. 
We're going to turn off the light just so we can show you this piece. So this is a, um, this is a mixing bowl for a Hamilton Beach stand mixer. And it is in the custard color. And look at that. What a nice glow that is. There goes my flashlight. This is the color that it is naturally. It's like a creamy, yellowy white. It's custard color. Like custard that's like in Bavarian donuts. Bavarian cream. Yes, like Bavarian cream. Exactly. Exactly. But there you go. So this bowl is $12 and it's number 48. $12, number 48. No cracks, no chips. There's the Hamilton Beach on the bottom. Uh, pickled Tink. Pickled Tink. You got it, Pickled Tink. I forget your first name, Pickled Hey, Winking Owl Antiques, Barb. How you doing? Susan. Okay, I can remember that. Congratulations, Susan. All right, we're going to do one more regular item, and then we're going to do an offer up. Shannon Zett said she thinks that she got that. Uh, we're double checking, Shannon. I have you a second on my end. We have you a second on our end. You're always going to see yourself as first, Shannon, on your on your end. So, um, you know, you can refresh and make sure that you're in live chat and not top chat. All right, next I have this awesome specimen of a rooster specimen yes he's fabulous look at those look at those buns look at look at the bun look at he's got some serious buns going on there not to mention those awesome feathers absolutely and that chest yes he is fabulous and this guy is $13, number eight. $13, yes, number eight. Yes, Gina. <laughs> yeah, he's cool. Cheryl Hoskin. Oh, no. Nope. It wasn't. Belinda Carroll. Belinda Carroll. Sorry, Cheryl. I know, the fat fingers. I know how that goes. Belinda Carroll, you got them. All right. Okay, everybody, we're getting ready to do an offer up. So if y'all want to go out and come back in, refresh, whatever you would like to do. So I purchased this piece at an antique mall and I actually just realized that it was um, repaired. So um, it is this beautiful Royal Copley little Asian boy planter. It's a wall pocket and a planter, I guess. There is the Royal Copley. You can see there's the hole to hang it on the wall. Um, I just saw that it was repaired right here. Now, you can see it on the inside, but you cannot see it on the outside at all. So only on the inside is it noticeable. 
Now, um, he does have a lot of crazing because he is old. I'm sure you can see the crazing. But look at that face. OMG, he is adorable. He is so cute. So we are going to start offers for this little guy. As soon as Jessica puts start in the chat, we are going to start offers at $15 for this little guy. So get ready, everybody. Oh, man, I'm looking for my emoji. All right, ready? Ready? Start. <laughs> $15 is the starting offer on this little guy. I love him. Oh, you like the cowbell? I have two of them, actually. No offers, huh? Not on my end. Nobody likes this little guy? Oh, my gosh. Oh, Lori. Lori offered. So we have Lori at 15. You guys have a minute. Uh, well, it was a minute and 30 seconds. Elizabeth Gove is We're at, at 16. Seconds. We have 45 seconds left. Hey, Alex, what's going on? They're not wrinkles. It's just crazy. That's right. We have Celeste at 17. Casey's fine at 19. Celeste at 21. How we much time is left? Seconds. There's 15 seconds left, everyone. Elizabeth Gove is at 23. Celeste is at 26. Five. Four, three, two, one. All right, let's see who we got. We're going to refresh. Oh, he's so cute. Um, let's see. I got Celeste and SATX at 29. Celeste at twenty nine dollars. You you are the winner. Congratulations. Woohoo! He is so cute. I love him. I can't tell you. I picked him up like fifteen times, and finally I just said, I don't care. I'm getting him. <laughs> All right. All right, we're going to do another set of uh, salt and pepper shakers. This is my last set of salt and peppers, I believe. Um, these are really nice if you have um, a, Tus an army. a Tuscany theme going on. An army over for dinner? An army over for dinner, yes. These have the olives on here. They are good size, okay? They are like... Big. They're like five and a quarter inches tall, but they're really, really nice, nice pattern. And you don't have to constantly refill them either, you know. They are made by CIC. They both have their stoppers. So these are going to be, where's my ticket? Uh, twelve dollars, and they are number twenty-seven. Twelve dollars, number twenty-seven. Oh, Tiger's here. Oh, Linda Dickerhoff. Hey, Tiger. Linda Dickerhoff. You got them. Number twenty-seven, Linda. Thank you, Linda. No, a minute and 30, because it gives time for the lagging people. All right. Let me do this one first. I have this gorgeous plate. Um, it is, I guess they're called portrait plates. 
I've tried to sell this one time before and I thought I would give it another go. I just think it's beautiful. Now this is not a crack. This is like right in the paint. It looks like they had an oopsie with the paint and just left it like that. Um, but it is gorgeous. Isn't it pretty? Um, it just has numbers on the back. Uh, but this plate is nine and three quarter inches around. This is $12 and it's number 36. $12, number 36. We have Shannon Zett. Shannon Zett. You got it. Thank you very much. Hmm. Put it there. All right. Now, to go on either side of that plate, I have these two. And these are eight inches around. But they, the one does have some paint loss. So we have this the one. Um, no, 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 I mean like the both the plates. It's the same chip, yeah. isn't it? You can see this one here has um, a lot of the gold is missing. But this one is in pretty good shape. But it does have a chip. This one has a little chip right here. So you would get the set of two for $12, number 42. $12, number 42. Nothing on the back. Shannon, Shannon Zett. There you go, Shannon. Now you got a little grouping. <laughs> Perfect. All right, let me put these over here. All right. Uh, let me see. All right, um, I have another Cape Cod piece. This beautiful bell. I, I, I could swear I sold one of these already. Um, but I do have another one. I hate to pass these up. They're so pretty. The color is gorgeous. And it is an Avon piece. It's $10 and it's number 41. $10, number 41 for the Cape Cod Bell. KC's, KCS Fine. Is it KC's Fine? Yes. Congratulations, Casey's fine. And Casey, what, Judy? Because <laughs> trust me, my mouth is much louder than a bell. <laughs> All right. Let's see here. Um. Okay. Oh, in case you're ill. Oh, oh, okay. Yeah, I can just see me going ding, 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 and my son being downstairs with this headphones on. That's not working well. Nope. I'll just use my big mouth. <laughs> yes. Yes, we are, Linda. Who passed away this morning? Oh, Larry King passed away this morning. Oh, okay. That's the one you thought we were talking about before. Yeah. Oh, from COVID. Oh, my goodness. Hi, Nancy Robertson. 
Wow. Hey, Tammy. Wow, yeah. I'll tell you what, COVID has taken a lot of lives, a lot of people, at, and they're young. They are young. Like 60 is young, as far as I'm concerned. He was 87, yeah. But I'm saying, like, I was recently watching um, on YouTube um, a lot of deaths in the month of January from COVID. And a lot of these people were in their 50s and 60s that died from COVID. Crazy shit. All right. Um, next up is another gorgeous piece. This is a beautiful piece of, I believe it is Fenton, and it is the lime green satin glass. And it is a candy dish with butterflies. It is just beautiful. No cracks, no chips. It is just beautiful. I love this design. It's gorgeous. And as you saw, it does glow if my light would work. This is $18, number 20. $18, number 20. What? My oh my. Oh, well, I'm sure $20, but. Oh, okay. So who got the number? I mean, that's up to you. It's, it's 20.00. Okay. Um, well, I'm going to go with what my oh my. Um, she did put 20 in, but it was dollars, but it's still number 20. So I will, I am going to go with what my oh my on this uh, candy dish. Oh, you said I should have offered it at 20. Oh, okay. So then it would be, um, gotcha. So it'll go to the aging beginner. I forget her first name, but I, she bought for me before. I, what's your first name again, Aging Beginner? Because I forgot. Nancy. Okay. So, Nancy, you got it. All righty. Um, let's do another linen piece. Next, I have this beautiful tablecloth. Um, it does have a few stains on it. Nothing like major, you know, where you would be like, oh, I can't use that. You know, nothing like that. Um, it is a 50 by 46 square. I believe it is square, but this is the pattern, and there is a small stain right there. You can see the yellowish. But uh, let me see, and there's a little stain here. So, as I said, it's 50 by 46, and it's really, really pretty. You know, yeah, there's a couple stains here and there. But I did not wash this, so if whoever gets it, you can um, 
pre-treated or whatever, um, it is going to be $15 and it's number 37. $15, number 37. Elizabeth Gove. Elizabeth Gove. You got it. All right. Um, I have a craft lot. And it just made sense to me to just do these, these uh, four pieces all together because they are very similar with each other instead of doing them separate. So... First, to start out this lot, we have, this is a brand new in the box. It is called Your Story Album Kit. And it, it includes um, a book binder. No, wait a minute, hang on. It comes with an eight by eight inch album cover, 11 double-sided printed pages, an eight by eight inch Three sheets of stickers, eight by eight inch as well. So that's what's in this box. Then we have this whole packet uh, full of goodies. And I will show you what is in here. So in here, there are these little um, things that someone punched out already. There are bobby pins, metal bobby pins. For your hair? I guess. I don't know. Whatever you use them for. I don't do scrapbooking. Excuse me, so I don't really know. Then we have uh, mini candy bar wrappers. And then we have all kinds of sheets of paper. There's a whole bunch of sheets like this. Then we have like six of these. And like six of these. There's probably six of those as well. Looks like there's about six of each one of these. This pattern. And this pattern. And then we have, now this is Martha Stewart. Uh, this is 12 sheets. And those are the, the patterns that come in the package. 12 sheets. And then this one is another, um, this is 18 paper patterns, two sheets of each. And that's what those look like. So, we have all of that in this one package. And plus you get this, um, the nice uh, holder for it. Then we have this, which is really nice. Um, this you could use as a cutting mat, but then inside, it's like an organizer. It has all kinds of different little um, 
envelopes and of course it's not gonna paper envelopes anyways I can't hold it up guys because my shoulders killing me but it's got all kinds of little sections in here and places to hold stuff together so you will get this piece as well Ugh. Then you will also get this awesome scrapbook, brand new, still sealed, um, 60 pages, 12 by 14, bonus 100 corner mounts included. Nita May, what are you typing numbers in for? Yeah, we have a, um, uh, this is a set price, Nita. And then, last but not least, you will get this really cool, um, whoops. It's like a photo album, like, scrapbook. It's got all different. You just have to put the pictures in and, like, yeah. stickers and stuff. Yeah, yeah. So, basically, you are getting one, two, three, and four, five. You're getting five awesome items in this lot. And the price is... It was in here. <laughs> um, I just, I just need the number. It should say a craft lot. Oh, craft lot! I was looking for scrapbooking. No, it's uh, it's craft lot. Uh, it's. Thirty-six dollars. Thirty-six dollars. Number thirty-five. Number thirty-five for all of those items. Reclaim treasures by Mary. Yes, because Mary's doing junk journaling. You got it, Mary. <laughs> there you go. You're all set, girl. <laughs> Wow, that was a workout, just trying to show it. Holy cow. All right, there you go, Mary. <laughs> All right, um, I'm going to do one more regular item, and then I'm going to do another offer up. All right. Um, Christy, Shoot. you have uh, her email address. Wrong. Well, kind of. It's Hazel at Gale 63 at AOL.com and you have dot net. Dot com, not dot net, Miss Christie. Thank you. That's okay. That's all right. Thank you though. Thank you so much for doing that. Yeah, we we appreciate it. We appreciate it. it, absolutely. So it's um dot com and not dot net. Okay. My next item is this set of three decorative plates in a grape pattern. These are pretty. I like these. So there's these two. And this one goes like that. Bye, Nate. Thank you for popping on. I hope you feel better, bud. So you get the set of three. Uh, $12, and they're number 44. $12, number 44. Poor Nate. Cheryl Haskins. Cheryl Hoskins, you got them.
thank you much. Hey, Colleen. <laughs> All right. So anybody um, that came in after, um, if you are new and you have never bought from me before, please email me your name, your full mailing address with the zip code, and your PayPal email address before you even um, start to do any offers or anything. Thank you so much to all of my helpers, Katie and Christy. Angela was here. Thank you so much, you guys. And my daughter, she's helping me today. All right, uh, offer up, here we are. Let's, no, I'm gonna do this one. All right. So if anybody wants to refresh, go right ahead. I can wait a minute while you guys do that for this next offer up. No, they're two different people. Um, Helen. That's okay, Jackie. Don't worry about it. I, I do the same thing. I, I I can't really help Alex when at her sale because I'm packing while I'm watching her sale. So all right, so what is my next offer up? You might ask. <gasps> Hey now. hey now. Oh, Binks has made his presence known, everyone. Hello, sir. Hi. Hello. He just dove up on the table. Hey, Binksy. Oh, you're packing mine hey. now. Make sure you do a good job. <laughs> hey, Binksy. Hey. <laughs> All right. Oh, so. My next offer up item is going to be this gorgeous chocolate pot set. This is absolutely beautiful. However, it does have some issues. So it is the chocolate pot that comes with four cups. None of the cups have any issues. They're perfectly fine. No chips, no cracks, nothing. They are all in perfect condition. The cocoa pot is in great condition. There's no cracks or chips up here on the top at all. Um, I don't see... Oh. I don't see any issues. Here is the stamp. <laughs> Bavaria. So, so I do feel like there is a little, a little, a little chippy right here on the bottom. Just a little teeny one right there. Okay, so, so the, the cocoa pot is in excellent condition other than that little tiny uh, flea bite on the bottom. Now, it also comes with this beautiful little plate, uh, which I am thinking if you, if you were going to use this for um, a cocoa pot, maybe you could put uh, marshmallows in this plate. If you wanted to use this as a teapot, you could serve slices of lemon. Um, now this does have a, a very large chip out of the bottom. But of course, it's not a big deal when it's sitting on the table. I don't think anybody's gonna go, hey, you know, there's a hunk missing out of there. <laughs> so, and this also has the stamp on the back. 
Okay, Maria, thank you for coming by. So the offer up is going to be for the whole set. You will have a minute and 30 seconds to put your offers in. And as I said, it is for the four cups, the pot, and the little dish. We are going to start offers for this set at $25. So as soon as we put start, start. Yes, this is a gorgeous piece. I love the colors. Look at that blue. And like I said, it has like a luster wear type finish to it. It's just, it's stunning. It really is. All the cups are marked on the bottom. We have Lisa Jones at 40. Just gorgeous. Nita May is at 41. This would set would look great with Trisha's cake plate tonight's sale. <laughs> How much time do we have? Uh, 26 seconds. 26 seconds. 26 seconds. So, so, so far, I believe Nita May uh, has it with $41, I believe. That's what Ten it's seconds. looking like. 10 seconds. 10 seconds. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Stop. All right, we will refresh and see who the winner is. Uh, Nita May, 43. Nita May got it for $43. Thank you, Nita May. Gorgeous set. Wait till you get it. You're going to love it. All righty. Uh, let me see. I have, um, I have quite a few pieces of milk glass left that I want to do as well. So let me do this piece first. This is like my only Valentine's themed piece. And it is this adorable Winnie the Pooh planter. Look at him, look how cute he is. Absolutely adorable. Hey there, Maricha. I think I said that right. You'll bet on the items on my shelf. <laughs> <laughs> As you can see, it says Disney on there. <laughs> Let's say that's springy. Yeah, he's cute. Um, but he's got a heart, so he could be used for Valentine's Day. So um, this little guy, let me pull out the tag. This is $14, and it's number nine. $14, number nine. Lori C. Lori C. You got it. Yeah, he's adorable. I love Winnie the Pooh. All right, next uh, up. Blue farmer. Yeah. Yep. Um. I have a piece that I think I originally purchased from Trisha at Sandy and Otto with the intentions of keeping it for myself, but I never I never went the route of mid-century modern. 
So I am going to resell it. And it is this awesome mid-century modern nutcracker dish. Um, it's in really great condition. I mean, it does have like surface scratching on there on the bottom from being slid, you know, across the table. But it's really so, so cool. Ron needs that. No, because cashews, only if he ate walnuts. <laughs> no, chestnuts. You crack chestnuts. Chestnuts, walnuts. Yeah, it is very cool. Show it to you up close. Really, really awesome. So this piece is $15, and it's number 43. $15, number 43. Elizabeth, thank uh, you, love. Everybody's buffering. I wonder how come. I don't know, but mine's still, like, circling. No, nobody called. My phone's on Do Not Disturb. I don't know what's going on, but I my phone's on Do Not Disturb, okay. so... Well, Nobody I, called. I closed out and came back in. Okay, so I guess close out and come back. I don't know what's... It's probably YouTube. Who knows? All right. Yes. All right. All right. I, I'm 25 more minutes. Okay. Next, I have a beautiful Fenton pitcher, hobnail pitcher. Uh, it still has the sticker on the inside. It is six inches tall, no cracks, no chips. It is $12, number 18, $12, number 18. Uh, Linda Dickenhoff. Linda, Linda, Linda. You got it. Oh, there went my candle. Yeah, Big wants it. No, I need it. Oh, he said that's us. <laughs> he said, Excuse make up your mind. Me. Do you want me on the table or? Excuse me. <laughs> All right. Um. I have another tablecloth. This one is 62 by 46 square. Now, depending on what light you're in, um, it could look like a pinkish color or a beige color. Beige to me. So, excuse me. Anyways, <laughs> anyways, so this is what it looks like. Hey, buddy. I guess it does kind of look pinky. It has beautiful, like, doily crocheted flowers. Or, am I showing that where they can see it? Um, no, move it down. <laughs> I can't see. Uh, okay, well. How's that? God. Pull it back towards you a little bit. I am. Okay. <laughs> and then it has it on the corners. And it also comes with some napkins. There are one, two, there's five napkins, and each napkin has a little um, embroidered corner. And then 
and I didn't see any like real stains or anything on this. It's in really great condition. So this is going to be $16. I don't know what you do with it. It's on here somewhere. Here oh, it is. It's number 24. Number 24, $16. Number 24. <laughs> Allie, Allie, okay, you got it, Allie. -o. Wow, that was difficult. All right. Okay, next I have, this is absolutely beautiful, and I cannot believe I'm getting rid of this. I can, you never used it. I just, I just got it recently. It's gorgeous. This is from 1937. Um, Scott from the old Curiosity Shop uh, commented in, in the video where I showed this that it was from 1937. And he did say who made it, but I forgot. But it is this gorgeous, elegant depression glass relish dish with the etched flowers going all around. It is just beautiful. It is the color of honey. Just beautiful. Good thing we don't have any like dinners where we need relish trays. <laughs> I know. <laughs> this beautiful piece is going to be $15, and it's number 34. $15, number 34. Pickled Tink. Pickled Tink. You got it. Gorgeous piece. Way do you get it and see it in person. And it is actually, it's like 12 and a quarter inches long by 10 and a quarter inches wide. So it's a nice size too. Ah, yeah. 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 Continue your live sale. Yeah, uh-huh. Where did this a week ago get off my back? Pardon me? I said, where did this a week ago get off my back, lady? Next is a, a pair of roosters. Um, they are, this one is definitely older, and this one, I'm not sure. I think this one is newer, but we have this little guy here. I love the holes here on the tail. That's the bottom. And I love the blue and white. Beautiful. You're pulling the, the tripod. Oh, sorry. <laughs> so you get the set of them for $12 and they are number 25. $12, number 25. Uh, Jeffrey Ross. Jeffrey Ross. They are yours. That's like a really professional name. All right. I have another uh, really nice piece of milk glass. Again, it's um, hobnail. And I'm not really sure. I mean, you could put anything in here. You could put candy in it. You could put olives, uh, cashews, cheese, um, whatever you would like. It's a beautiful piece. No cracks, no chips. Boy, who are you telling, Randy? 
Can you see the flames coming out of my nostrils? You look like a pimple. Uh, this is $12, number 19. $12, number 19. Yeah, it's beautiful. Lois Hoover. Hello, Lois. Hi, Binksy. Where you want to Binksy? Lois. Excuse me. That's my paper. Oh, no, don't do this to me. No, no, mm. no, 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 Mom. Mom. <laughs> 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 Why? <laughs> Oh my god. Uh, and it's freaking inviting hey. you up here. <laughs> I'm showing you. <laughs> oh my god. He's digging his nails right into her shoulder. <laughs> Dude, let go. Sorry. <laughs> god, <you're wrong. laughs> yes, I'm biting my tongue too. Oh, he is, he is, though. He is, like, such a lovey-dovey cat. That's how it, I got him. He was grabbing me. Yes, when when they went to the SPCA to look for cats for me. Well, it was originally just supposed to be one. Well, it was just supposed to be one. And then they we were, were walking. We were looking for a kitten. What the hell are you doing? <laughs> you smell like tuna fish. Oh. You smell like tuna fish. <laughs> but anyways, when they were walking by his cage, he was poking his arm out Literally and grabbing, grabbing them as they were walking by. And that's how he got picked. He picked them, actually. So there you go. <laughs> so he's still the same way. <laughs> um, all right. So I have, <laughs> oh wait guys, look, 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 hold on. <laughs> Are you kidding me right now? This cat is a nutcase. <laughs> oh boy. Oh. All right, so <laughs> let me do um, let me do a couple other regular pieces here. <laughs> Took Jessica's wedding card and put it in the fishing hole today. Okay, all right, so like, next up, I have this real pretty little butterfly trinket dish with the little uh, Lily of the Valley flowers on there. Um, there's no cracks, no chips. Um, it's not marked on the bottom. I didn't see anything. Of course, I forgot to take the sticker off, but there's no markings on the bottom. It's just a really pretty little um, little dish. It is $8, and it's number six. $8, number six. Reclaim Treasures by Mary. You got it, Mary. Thank you. Mary, I got my salt and pepper, or my shakers today. Oh, my God, I love them. Love them. Oh, yeah. All right. Next, I have a set of Pottery Barn pillar candle holders. Are those real silver? Um, I don't know, I but they do they have. Kind of look like it. They do have some weight to them, but there's a set of three. We have these two. And then we have this uh, shorter one. So it's three graduated sizes. And they're in pretty good condition. They do have some signs of wear. 
where it the, has the discoloration as if it would be real silver. Right. And that's, there it is on the bottom, Pottery Barn. This is a really, really nice um, set. Like I said, it does show some signs of wear, but to me, it just, they, that gives it that look. So I like it. It doesn't, it doesn't bother me at all. But they are really, really nice. Um, so you get the set of three, and they are $24, and they are number one. $24, number one. Uh, Deanna Church. Deanna! You won! <laughs> you won! Yay! All I saw is dog. Wait a minute. Is your dog better? Who's dog? She said, yay, I told you. <laughs> yay, Deanna. All right. Next up, I have another set of these um, Yankee Candle tea light holders. So there's a set of three little flowers and these are going to be eight dollars and these are normally four dollars each so these are eight dollars number 32 eight dollars number 32 judy reardon judy reardon you got them um, is there something specific that you want my help with for the last 10 minutes? Um, um, I'm going to do an, uh, this offer up. I can probably uh, do like the rest if you want to just, uh, we'll do this offer up. Jessica has to go somewhere, so um, we'll do this offer up. And then if you just wanted to take well, this stuff in there. Too. Yeah, I know. That's okay, though. I can probably, we'll see. We'll see what we can do. Um, let me do, I'm going to do the offer ups guys. Um, at least, at least two of them right in a row, um, because she's got to leave. So, so we're going to do an offer up right now. And, um, this is an amazing piece. I love it. So, um, first of all, let me. Where is, figures. All right, my next offer up item is this. Gorgeous owl tea light holder. Um, it is Fenton, I believe. And, hold on. It glows. Hang on. No, just, just I actually just take the little head off. Nope. Yeah. There it is. So this is um a lime green color. It's gorgeous. So we're going to start offers on this amazing fairy lamp. The offers are going to start as soon as we type start in the chat and offers are going to start at $15. Are we ready? Start. This is awesome. So right now, uh, Jeffrey Ross is leading with $50. Jeffrey Ross is at $50. Diana Green, $65. Wow. 
Sue Golombeski, 66. Less than a minute. Less than a minute, everyone. Cheryl Hoskins, 80. Wow. Yeah, he's awesome. Okay, so Bernice is out. Diana Green is at 85. How much time is left? 30 seconds. We have 30 seconds left. Jeffrey is out. Cheryl is at 90. No cracks, no chips. Sue Golombeski is out. Diana Green is at 95. How much time? Uh, 10 seconds. 10 seconds left. Cheryl is at 100. Stop. Stop. All right, we are going to refresh and see who got this gorgeous tea light. Diane Green at 107. Diane Green, you are the winner of this gorgeous fairy lamp. Oh, sorry, Diana. Diana, my Diana, my Diana Green for 100 and what? $107. $107. Thank you very much, Diana. Trust me, this will be wrapped well. Along with all my other items, but. <laughs> Congratulations. All right. I'm going to do another offer up before my daughter has to go. Um, my next offer up item is going to be for this gorgeous lady figurine. Uh, her name is Lady Juliet. And she is made by Napco. I don't know if you can see that, but it says Napco. And she has no issues. I looked her over with a fine tooth comb. The only thing I saw is this teeny, teeny little flea bite right there on the bottom of her dress. Just like little chips of paint. Yeah, she has them in a couple spots, a couple like little teeny flea bites but her fingers are all there her head was not glued back on you know she's in really great condition yes it is a it is a dark green and pink and she is um she's eight and a half inches tall and she is six and a half inches wide across the bottom. So we are going to start offers on her at um, $12. And we shall start. You have a minute and 30 seconds to put offers. So I see Colleen at 20. Is she the one that you have the name Lady Juliet? Yes. Okay. Lady Juliet. She's gorgeous. All right. Well, this is going up for trying to explain. Elizabeth is at 22. Colleen is at 25. Yeah, she is beautiful. You did these, right? Yeah. Yep. Hey, Kathy. That's okay, honey. We all have lives, you know. We, it doesn't revolve around YouTube. <laughs> 26 for Debbie Vitale. I can't see how much time is left. That's okay. 28 for Colleen. Yeah, her collar's awesome. Uh, 30 seconds. 30 seconds. Yeah, she's, she's beautiful. 
Like I said, I love pink and green. So we're at 29 for Debbie. Elizabeth is out. 10 seconds. <laughs> 10 seconds, sis. Five. Four, three, two, one. Stop. <laughs> sis said, my life revolves around YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> We're refreshing. All right. Um, I got Colleen Body Tote. Colleen. At $30. For $30. You got her, Colleen. Thank you so much. Binks is back again. All right, buddy. You gotta you have to go. I gotta finish. I'm trying to hurry up. All right, so that is sold. I'm sorry if I butchered your last name. <laughs> She's not real good at people's names, so I don't know. She called you Th Thody or something? Yeah, it's T-H-O-D-A-Y. Is it Thoday? Thoday? This sold, too. Yeah. I'm okay. Um, this. That, yeah, yep, yeah. yep. D. Okay, it is so day. All right, just just checking. Just want to make sure. I'm just trying to move this stuff over so she, ah, so she could take it in the back room for me. Hi, Binksy. What are you doing, Binksy, baby? Oh my god. Did I do? I didn't do this one. I didn't oh do these my two yet. Speech. Take this all by itself. <laughs> all right. Okay, guys. So. All right. So I have a couple, I have three more pieces of hobnail milk glass. Oh, I won't break the owl. I told her, don't take anything else in your hands besides the owl. <laughs> um, I have this really pretty uh, little, just a little ruffledy, ruffledy, ruffly uh, hobnail, like a little trinket dish. There's no cracks, no chips. These are all from my, my own collection. See you later, Anne-Marie. Thanks for stopping in. Au revoir. <laughs> um, this is $8, and it is number two. $8, number two. Pamela Hammett. Pamela Hammett. Thank you, Pamela. All right. Next I have um, this beautiful, you're welcome, thank you. This beautiful, um, it looks like white glass to me. Um, gorgeous uh, hand-painted flowers. Um, it does have some paint loss on the gold. TTFN, y'all. See you later, Jess. In case anybody's wondering, TTFN means ta, -ta for now. Right. Um, and then there's also paint loss on the gold around the bottom. I don't think it glows. Ooh. Does that glow? No. It's purple, but it doesn't glow. <laughs> um, so the issue that I have is it looks to me that's this, the bottom piece was broken off and was glued back on. If you could see that on the bottom, but what's really weird is that it's all smooth. 
It's all smooth and it's it's just weird, but it doesn't take away from like it's not going to like fall off or anything. I mean, it looks almost like it was melted back together. That's what it looks like to me. But um, well, the light is purple. See, it's a purple black light. So when you put it in there, it looks purple. So anyways, this piece, it is really, really pretty. It is eight inches tall and it is going to be $12 and it's number four, $12 number four. Linda Dickerhoff, okay, Linda. You got it. Thank you, ma'am. All right. Um, I have three regular pieces left and two offer ups. So let me get my hobnail pieces done and out of the way. I have another, this is really pretty. This is another, uh, you could use it for olives, you could use it for cashews, candy, whatever you would like. Um, it's in perfect condition. The only thing is that this piece does show wear. You can see where the silver is has come off. Because, you know, it's probably from the 50s. So that's the only issue with it. So this is $12 and it's number 33. $12, number 33. Linda. Linda Dickerhoff. Thank you, Linda. All right, and my last piece of uh, hobnail is this beautiful, it is a footed, ruffled taper candle holder, I believe. It's either for a tapered candle um, or an, an epern horn. Epern horn, but I don't think so. I believe that is for a taper candle. Um, like I said, perfect condition, no cracks, no chips. It is five and a half inches tall, and it is about seven inches um, across. It's $12 and it's number 14. $12, number 14. Pamela Hammett. You got it, Pamela. Thank you. All right. My next regular item and my last regular item is actually um, this very cool, um, actually it used to hold some kind of liquor um, because the top says uh, LaRoe Liquors. So it has like a cork as you can see, there's a cork, and then it has this piece as well. It says USA on the bottom. Epern horn, yeah, that's what I was saying. <laughs> yes, moonshine. Um, I can't get this off, nor am I going to try because I don't want to break anything. 
but I think it's a really cool piece. And it's $12 and it's number five. $12, number five for the liquor container. Jeffrey, Jeffrey Ross, you got it. All right. All right. Uh, oh, I lied. I have one more item. <laughs> Um, my next, um, item is this really cool set. This is from Hallmark. And what this is, is it is, uh, a, two sets of, uh, decks of cards and your score pad. So if you want to play 500 Rummy with somebody or 21, it comes with the score pad and two brand new decks of cards. Nice little set. It was never used. There's Binks again. So this nice little set is $10 and it's number 11. $10, number 11. Elizabeth. You got it, Elizabeth. Thanks. Can you get off my paper? Thank you. All right. Okay. So we're down to my last two offer up items. Um, so I have to get my little timer here. Where is it? One minute, 30 seconds. All right. So my next offer up item are, it is this set of um, snack plates and cups made in occupied Japan. We have a green one with a green cup and it has the pretty floral design on the inside that black dot is right in the glaze. It does not come out. I can't get it out. So we have a green one. We have two blue ones. Now this one has lost a lot of its uh, shine on the outside. So there's two, um, two blue ones, and here is the other blue cup. As you can see, this one has a lot more shine than the other one. And then we have, it's like a uh, burnt orange color with the matching cup. So it is the set of four, the four plates and the four cups from Occupied Japan. So I'm going to start offers on these at um, $15. And we shall start now. I don't know where she put the cowbell. Oh. I didn't know you wanted it. No, that's all right. Oh, wait. Ah. I'm already on my way. <sighs> oh. Thanks. <laughs> all right. Toodles. All right. I'll see you later. All right. So we're at Elizabeth with $18. See you later, Banksy. We have one minute remaining. Really a gorgeous set. And they're definitely bone china because they're really, really thin. 
and um, I wouldn't have gotten them, I don't think, if it wasn't for the fact that they were made in occupied Japan. But, you know, they're old when they're from occupied Japan. So we are down to 30 seconds for this beautiful set. I know, they're gorgeous. They really are. So I think right now Elizabeth Gove has it. Oh, there's Christy. We have uh, five seconds left. Four, three, two, one. All right. So, all right, let me, let me refresh and go back in. Okay, we have Elizabeth Gove at $25. Congratulations, Elizabeth, you got them. They're beautiful. Great buy. All right, let me write that down. Uh, where are we? Here we are. All right. And my last offer up item. Binks took my candle. He was playing hockey with it. So um, I can't light up this fairy lamp. But we have the Stars and Bars fairy lamp as my last offer up item. I got to get my timer back here again. We are going to start the offers on this fairy lamp at $12. So as soon as everybody's ready, we will start. And I can't type start in there and run the timer at the same time. So I'm just going to say, there you go, Tippy. Thank you. <laughs> So, so far we have Bernice Marie, oh, wait, Carla, 30. Carla Salamone at 30. Kathy Morrison is at 32. They are, they're gorgeous. I had it lit up when I did my haul video, but like I said, Binks took my, my tea light, so... <laughs> So we're, we have less than a minute left, and we have Carla at 38. This would look gorgeous with fairy lights in it, too. Kathy Morrison is out. Bernice is at 40. Sue Golombeski is at 41. Mr. L. Page is at 41. Pamela is out. Carla's at 45. We have 30 seconds left. Sue is at 46, and they're coming around the stretch. <laughs> Bernice is out. Mr. L. Page is at 47. We have 17, 14, 13. Carla's at 50. 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Stop. All right. Let me go back on my YouTube here and refresh. And it is looking like we have um, Old Stuff Beth at $57. Old Stuff Beth at $57. Congratulations, Beth. You got it. All right. 
Well, guys, that is everything that I have for you today. Um, I thought it was a really, really great sale. Um, I do plan on having a lot more um, items like this. And um, I hope you guys enjoyed it today. Um, thank you so much. Um, so I will probably have invoices out either late Sunday evening or early Monday morning. Um, <clears throat> excuse me. And I just wanted to let everyone know that I am also, um, not only am I doing a sale the first Tuesday of every month with Crafty Jackie, um, I'm also going to be doing um, a sale with uh, Stephanie at Thrifting Adventures um, the second Tuesday in February, which is February 9th, on her channel. So it should be a lot of fun. So I just want to thank all of you for um, being at my sale today. Um, and I would like to thank everybody, um, all my new subscribers. And if all of you that are here are not subscribed to my channel, please consider subscribing. I would greatly appreciate it. All right, guys, I will catch you in my next video. Bye.